This is the center of the Star Wars galaxy for the next four days. In case you hadn't realized, this year marks the 40th anniversary of Star Wars. The president of Lucasfilm, Kathleen Kennedy. The greatest honor for me is to acknowledge the man whose collective genius has brought us all together today. Please welcome George Lucas. Does that always happen when you walk into a room? Not like this. The best part was just to be able to see everybody again. Anthony Daniels, Peter Mayhew, and Billy D. Williams. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Hamill. What's overwhelming is the support of the fans. It's unbelievable. It doesn't get much more epic than this, does it? Or actually, maybe it does. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Harrison Ford. Generations of fans after 40 years is very gratifying. He got the part because in the end, I said, you know how to fly? I said, fly, yeah. <laughs> Land. And... <laughs> the storytelling is so primal. It's good versus evil. Please welcome Ian McDermott and Hayden Christensen. Sweetest guy in the world. <laughs> like great fairy tales. It's very clear, even to the youngest viewer. It was designed to be a film of you're 12 years old, you're going to go on into the big world, and here are some of the things you should pay attention to. Now it's my pleasure to introduce Dave Filoni. It's just a true thing in life, as you've always said. Just don't be afraid to make no decision out of fear. And an actor without a story to tell might as well go home. So it was a brilliant opportunity for all of us. He really created something quite exceptional. On behalf of all of us, thank you. Thank you. We can't celebrate 40 years of Star Wars without remembering our beloved princess. There was no greater honor than that of working with the late and truly great Carrie Fisher. She was unlike anyone you've known. My mom used to say she never knew where Princess Leia ended and Carrie Fisher began. She really is a modern woman. She was the boss. It was her war. She wore a dress through the whole thing, but she was the toughest one of the group. But she will be remembered forever, even by those who are not old enough yet to say the words, may the force be with you.